Hi there, now we are going to talk about anti-alias. Anti-alias is a technique that we are going to handle just in high level. So we are just configured and the library is going to resolve that problem. The problem is that we have pixelation in the edges of our shape as we can see in this example so the solution to this problem is go to the renderer which is webgl renderer and see the properties the parameters that we can send in his constructor method so <clears throat> if you looking for the parameter anti anti alias by default is true so we need to send the parameter anti alias equal true uh, find a, an example of this um, could be difficult so let me show you oh, let me take this out in the getting start in the scene creating a scene maybe we can find anti-alias in, in some way but no there there is not so the best suggestion that i can share you is go to examples go to the, the this example of the ants and check click on here in this icon that will send you to the code of that project and you will can you will find that the webgl renderer get this attribute with into the constructor method of the webgl renderer and that is the way that you can fix this problem just going to the renderer and adding to it the anti-alias parameter once you did once you have done this the look of this cube is better um, that's all by now the next in the next video we will fix the resize because at the moment if we open the development tools of we resize the the window uh, we have some issues so stay around and see you there